Alrighty guys, we got part three going on here of uh, some new cherry shrimp. Again, my first experience with it all, but uh, going through it together, as I said in the last part, is uh, doing some drip acclimation. So pretty much what I have is the tank water uh, dripping into the cup that we saw in the previous part. I don't know, it might be three drips a second, two drips a second, something like that. So it's going to take a little bit of a time. Uh, again, watching watching a guy on YouTube, this is kind of how he does it. He's got some fancy little knob or something that he can put in line to uh, decrease the drips. But uh, another way to do it, as you can see, is I got a knot in the, uh, in the end of the tube uh, for the siphon that's coming from the tank that they're going to actually go in. Uh, did some testing and everything on the uh, on the water seems to be within uh, in the parameters of what they need to what they need to be kept at my water here is a little hard unfortunately um, but I do have some things that I can add to the tank to uh, get rid of that hardness uh, those will be added actually I'm gonna work on that uh, as these guys are are getting dripped here uh, give me something to do so so really just kind of zoom in again. Pretty neat. They're just kind of swimming around and doing their thing. Getting used to the water. Just drip by drip. Again, let that fill up. Probably dump out half or maybe three quarters, something like that. Fill it up again, do that a couple of times. Make sure that they're well acclimated to it. Uh, just want to try to do it the right way, I guess. Uh, it's what I've read. So, anyways, is I'll just kind of pan over to the to the tank, kind of zoom out a little bit. So as you can see, I just got that tube going in the top, coming on down, created a siphon, uh, sucked on the end of the end of the tube there. Got a little siphon going, tied a knot in it. Got a couple of drips couple of drips a second anyways yeah we're down on the floor uh, wanted to get these wanted to get these guys uh, on a shelf but got these tanks had them had them going for about two weeks now and just got the itch to fill them up so be crawling around on the floor a little bit but we can do that so it's just kind of kind of a little setup again just just getting started um, I got plenty more to come. I got some ideas of the, some things that I want to do, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Make some make some YouTube videos of my experience. A little bit of a hobby I'm trying to get into. So, a little bit on the tank uh, right there. I'll try to pan out a little bit. Just got me a got me a ten gallon. Hang on the back filter. A couple of plants in there. Uh, Got a heater. Um, tried to set it on low just to get a little heat. I keep my heat in, in the house probably about 72. Um, and uh, the actual temperature gauge that's actually over here is holding about 70, 72, maybe 74. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but it might dip down a little bit. Right now I got a, uh, it might dip down a little bit at night. Right now I just got a, I don't know if I can show this, yeah, you can see the bulb there, it's actually a, a grow light. Uh, I'm into some, some flowers, some indoor flowers and plants and stuff like that, so uh, this, should be, this should be fine for now. Uh, order a couple of lights per aquarium off of Amazon, uh, but once those come in, and get everything up on the shelves, get it set up decently. Uh, we'll see how it goes. Again, just getting just getting into it kind of kind of got the itch couldn't wait no longer so again 10 gallon tank I'm gonna I'm gonna pull the heater out uh, a couple of live plants I do have a little bit of a feeding dish that I'm gonna put in there uh, got some driftwood that I'm gonna put in there and I also got some uh, Indian almond leaves uh, bring down the pH a little bit make it a little more I believe it's called brackish Make it a little more bit of a brackish water for them. Uh, again, uh, what I've seen in other videos. So there's my little setup. 
We got the drip acclimation going. A couple of drips a second. Shrimp are moving around. Things are going nice. A couple of hours, we should have some shrimp in the tank. I'll let you know, guys, know how it goes. Thank you.